Okay, y'all, what's poppin'? This hair I have in today is from West Kiss Hair. It's their 613 hair, and I have an 18-inch frontal, two bundles of 20-inch, and two bundles of 22. Right here, I'm just showing you guys how light the lace actually looks um, after basically making the hair and dyeing it whatever color you want to. So today, I'm going to teach you how to fix it up and get it poppin'. So I'm using the RIT dye in the color tan and I just put some water in a bowl, uh, warmed it up and then put the dye in there. Um, I'm putting salt, sea salt into the mixture. It'll take out all the reds um, from the color or what's it called? Fabric dye? Yeah. And then you want to put the RIT, I don't know how to say the name. I think it's Taupe or Taupe. I don't know. Y'all will see it. But yeah, I put that in there to make it a little lighter because it was too brown for my skin. Um, as you can see, I was doing the paper towel test and just like dipping it in the water to see what color it would actually turn the lace. Um, yeah, there you go. The top or top bay. I don't know what that's called. But I know you guys are going to ask about the hair color. All I did was use the Weller Toner in T18 and I did that for all the bundles in the frontal and that's basically it. So... <clears throat> now let's get into it this part was kind of hard when i first started because i was trying to like dip it well dip the lace slash the hair in there without getting the color onto the hair um because i didn't want the gray to turn colors or whatever i don't know it just i don't i was scared so what i ended up doing was going to get a makeup brush and i dipped the makeup brush into the mixture and i just rubbed it on the lace and that got the job done so um yeah that's basically all i did and i rinsed out the uh fabric color dye and i went on to apply the wig Now here, I finally put the wig back on my head, and as you can see, the 
lace matches my skin tone way better um if you are a darker skin tone they have dark darker color dyes for or from rit so just just go look them up you can try them out uh but to put down the wig all i did was use a bold hold i didn't use got to be glued today because you know it was great so you know the wig got to be laid for real or they just gonna know and they gonna see the little piece sticking up on the side so you got to make sure it's laid so yeah i basically did that put that on there little dots you don't need a lot from bold hold and I just kind of smeared it out and once it gets clear, dries clear, you just lay the lace over top of it. Um, for the hair, I wanted to go for a wet and wavy look instead of uh, just plain old straight. So um, I ended up just scrunching it with my Cream of Nature styling foam and that's basically it. The rest is pretty much self-explanatory. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you guys in the next one.